I saw a video by Scott the Waz about what he would want in a new Smash Bros. game when the next one inevitably comes out in 10 or so years. Maybe even 5, I don't know. So naturally I thought, why not make my own video on what I would want? First of all, we need to pick a title. And I think going back to the synonym for fight trend would be nice. Smash Bros. Battle is my preferred title. Going by his guidelines, I picked 30 characters and 5 newcomers to stay in Smash. And with 80 characters, including Echoes, it was hard to cut so many out. This would be my ideal roster with the given guidelines. There were a lot of characters that I didn't want to cut out. I thought Robin was more interesting than Marth, but Marth is way more iconic. I wanted to keep in Diddy, K. Roll, and Bidley, but there wasn't enough space for them. I would have kept in Pac-Man, Mega Man, Sonic, Snake, and even Ryu and Cloud over some other characters, but they're all third-party creations, and we want a more Nintendo-centric vibe. Now onto the newcomers. I wanted to put in Geno, but Geno is very unpopular and is only in one game. The only thing he really has is that he could be a really interesting and unique character that could represent the Mario RPGs. But no matter how much I will pray for him to be in, there is another character that fills that role perfectly. And that character is Paper Mario. Paper Mario could have a very different moveset from Mario, mainly because of his hammer and his partner's abilities, both of which could be used in his own moveset. I think it would be cool if he could like pull out his partners, but that would be kind of hard to do. Next up is Bandana D. Bandana D is more than just a Kirby Goomba with a hat. He also has a spear. But jokes aside, a spear wielder is something we don't have yet, and I think we need. And Piranha Plant proves that normal enemies could make it in. He also has starred in many games since Super Star Ultra, making him more of a main character than just Piranha Plant. Now, if this were a Smash Ultimate DLC wishlist, this spot would go to Sans. I think Sans genuinely would be a good Smash Ultimate DLC. Don't get angry at me. But this is supposed to be realistic for 5 or 10 years in the future. And I don't think Sans will be very relevant by then, not even as a meme. Hopefully he will, but I just don't think it's realistic. So this spot goes to Tingle. I don't know what his moveset would be, but I think there could there's material there to make Tingle a good character, and hopefully he'll be in Smash games in the future. Up next is another Zelda character, and that is the Skull Kid. If we are lucky, he won't just be an assist trophy by the next game, he might actually be a character. He, I think he has a lot of potential for moveset, and, but that said, I do have some bias because I think Majora's Mask is the greatest Zelda game of all time, but I mean... I think I think he'll actually be, he could be a good character, genuinely. And finally, we have Chibi Robo, who just needs some love. Seriously, Chibi Robo just mm, after after what what he's gone through, he just needs he just needs to be in Smash. He, this poor this poor guy, he, I feel so bad for him. When it comes to stages, I want an even mix of old and new. So st stages like Fountain of Dreams, Onet, Picto Chat, Spear Pillar. Smashville, Hyrule Temple, a few others, I mean, even bad stages like Pokey Floats and Hand and Bow, and of course Final Destination and Battlefield, which has been in every game, should be included, but of course there should be more new stages from games that come out around the time that this new Smash Brothers game would come out. Um, for the single player, I want a mix between the Brawl and Melee Adventure modes, with the stages of melee, but the boss battles uh, and cutscenes of subspace. And for all that is holy, if we could please get a four player mode for single player, I would die of happiness. I know, single player, four player, that's different, but I think it would be amazing to have four player subspace. To go more in depth on what I mean by the stages of melee, I mean, like though, I think it's only two, three stages in melee that you get to play through. And it's like Mario, Zelda, and then there's the one F-Zero, like, race to the finish kind of stage. I want more of those for other games, so like a Pikmin stage, a P uh, Pokemon stage, stuff like that. Where you travel through their worlds, which I think would be cool, but I guess designing a world map for that would be kind of hard. I'm not, I don't know. Spirits was not very good. I don't really want any more of that. Maybe the, the world map, though. I'd be cool with a 3D world map, or one like Brawl, or even the Spirits world map. Any of that would be cool, but I'm kind of more towards the Brawl style of the world map. 
Classic would be more similar to Ultimate, but with more special bosses, like how in Mega Man you fight Dr. Wily, but it's really Dr. Mario. Stuff like that. That would be really cool. And it also should have more mini-games instead of the one race to the finish. It should also have the trophy-grabbing mini-game from Melee, or the break the targets. Uh, there's the one that you stand on the platforms in 64s. All those. Trophies need to come back. The masterpieces need to come back, those little five minute demos. The chronicle should be included. I mean, pretty much just bring back the entire vault. We need stage builder, and we need home run contest. And if God loved me, we would have a melee style break the targets, where each character gets their own special kind of break the target stage. What I would give for a melee style break the targets. There should be a ranked mode that you can access right from the game, like for glory but also with a for fun mode where you can choose your own settings. The coin gambling and spectator should come back too. I'm not, I don't know. This wouldn't be my ideal Smash experience. I would want more third party characters in Geno, but with the limitations set by the amazing Scott the Waz, this would probably end up being my favorite Smash experience. I'm Marloin, and I will see you all next time.